So guys, listen, you know that we were meant to be sorting things out with Wagnificent. Keemstar wanted the name of a streamer who I've called out. Wagnificent said, show me the money. I'm in. Unfortunately, this has actually spiraled into something where Wagnificent is now hiding under his little rock. And he's doing everything he can to try and make sure that this fight never goes ahead. And how do I know? Well, I tried to sign into Twitter earlier on and I was met by this. We've temporarily limited some of your account features. Bad boy beaming. What happened? We have determined that this account violated the Twitter rules specifically for number one, violating our rules against violent speech. You may not share abusive content, harass someone or encourage others or other people to do so. As a result, we've temporarily limited some of your account features. While in this state, you can still browse Twitter, but you're limited to only sending direct messages to your followers. No tweets, retweets, fleets, follows, or likes. Your account will be restored in full functionality in 12 hours. You can start your countdown and continue to Twitter once you delete the content that violates our rules. Now, you might be wondering what tweet it was that violated the rules. And it's not even bad. This guy has got someone, him or his community, to spam report that tweet to get it taken down. That's the only thing I can think of. Take a look at this now. Remove tweet. Tweet one of one, violating our rules against violent speech. You may not share abusive content, harass someone, or encourage other people to do so, right? This is the tweet on August 12th. Yo, Keemstar, send Wagnificent a DM. This cheating wants to fight, so let's set it up. Wag's about to have his whole cheating career flash before his eyes once he feels the power of the first punch. He'll be begging the referee to stop the fight. Now, to me, that's clear as day talking about a boxing fight just simply because we're talking about the referee, we're talking about the first punch and so on. But for some reason, this tweet gets reported. I wonder who by? Hmm. Must be Wagnificent being absolutely terrified to actually fight me because since that original tweet where he said he was in, I don't believe for a second that he thought that it would be going ahead. And I think he's absolutely shit his pants. Now he doesn't want a single thing to do with this because he realizes the reality that he would get his ass handed to him by none other than me, bad boy Beeman. Wagnificent, you need to stop being petty. You need to stop sending reports like this over on Twitter. And man, the up. Get yourself in a pair of boxing gloves, get yourself in the gym and start training. This is your opportunity to try and put a stop to me because I've already stated I am willing to delete my channel if any one of you Warzone cheaters can beat me on a Misfits boxing show. And honestly, if you do, the bad boy beaming channel is gone. But based on this behavior, Wag, it doesn't seem like you really truly want it. Or at least you don't believe that you could beat me. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. I want to know why Wagnificent's turned so petty. Do you think this is absolutely ridiculous? Do you think he's really shown his true colors and being the little shitbag that he actually is? Let me know down below. And if you did enjoy today's video, guys, hit that thumbs up. Let's try and get this video to like, I don't know, let's say 100 likes. Can we do that? Try and get it to 100 likes. If you're new to the channel, guys, subscribe. Hit that notification bell for me so you don't miss our future uploads. Until next time, I'll see you later. <clears throat>